yeah, that was definitely a first for me. I've never seen an embedded built-in trampoline. Yeah. Usually they're in someone's backyard, right. I feel. Yeah. Uh, yeah. So that was pretty fun. That was at uh, also at a sort of interesting infrastructural spot, which was here. It was underneath this pedestrian bridge. Mm -hmm. And I think this pedestrian bridge is pretty cool because it was crowdfunded. Okay. Um, yeah. So instead of being like a municipal project, it's something, you know, they wanted to preserve this area. And, and so, you know, they just kind of crowdfunded and then, you know, there were some setbacks with it. And then eventually they were able to really bring that project to life. So this was the type of modular parklet that we built uh, next to Tomb on a little side street right next to the university. So you can see from the ground up this parklet coming to life. Uh, from the construction team working on building the structure bit by bit to then sort of moving in those larger pieces uh, to really put together the frame. And then, you know, even the small details like adding greenery and even some like solar powered party lights, it really just made such a welcoming space. And you can see the finished product there. They just turn out so beautiful. I mean, who wouldn't want to be there? And you can tell that because when we were working on it, people continuously stopped by asking what was going on and you know, I think some people from the neighborhood even stopped to help work on it or to bring waters by for them while they were working on it. Yeah. And then when when people went back later on to check on it, I know Simone from the university went back later to check and see how things were going after it was finished. And there were people just hanging out, relaxing on the structure and yeah. seemed to really enjoy it. Yeah. And it's quite beautiful. I mean, I, I, I paused on this one uh, mainly because you look so happy. 